<laughs> Hello everyone, my name is Creative. Welcome. <laughs> Hello everyone, my name is Creative and welcome to my new YouTube channel. And in this video, I'm going to be showing you how to create a custom avatar using Ready Player Me. Before we begin, we're going to head over to your browser and we're going to enter readyplayer.me. You will be taken to this landing page that you see on my screen. This is a cross game avatar platform for the metaverse for different applications. What you can do here, you can create self based avatars creation. So you can actually enter your own photo or you can create from scratch. You can do full body and you can do half body avatar types. This is, this is actually a cross platform SDK for Unity and Unreal Engine 4. And I think there's over 500 customized options uh, at the moment and I know they're growing and I just know they found I just found out they've also partnered with one of the biggest brands which is Adidas and we'll get into that a little bit later so that, let's actually dive in and we're gonna go ahead and enter hub um, since I've already logged into this part you might have to go in through the, a login process we're not gonna go through that it's a pretty simple process you just need to connect your MetaMask on the left hand side you'll see the navigation uh, right now we're on the home screen this will let you know how many avatars you've created how many apps you're connected to you can go ahead and actually customize this app right now and this is the share option where you can actually share uh, create a photo or actually share on your social media platforms and this right here is just some of the top platforms that are connected to ready player me under discover apps this is actually gonna show you what are the latest apps that are connected to this platform already or that are verified at the, at the moment. Wearable, uh, I know that they're working with some big brands like Adidas, so be on the lookout for that. I know you can connect your wallet or redeem some code. We can dive into that to a different video, but for today's video, we're gonna talk about how to actually create your new avatar. I already have some here at the bottom that I've already started playing with but let's actually dive in and actually create a new avatar. All right, to begin creating our new avatar, we're gonna go ahead and select this button that says create new avatar with the plus, select that. If you, you should get a pop-out button, if this is your first time, if not, we're gonna go ahead and select this plus button that says create new avatar. It's gonna go ahead and load for us. And there's a three step process that we're gonna go through. The first one is the body type where you're gonna select, are you a male, female, or you don't wanna be specific. Right now I'm gonna select male. And the next part, the next step is actually getting the best results for your, your face. And there's actually three options that you can do. One, you can actually take a photo, which just connects to your computer, or will turn on your camera. Second, you can actually select file where you can actually upload a photo, or you can select continue without a photo. For this video, I'm actually gonna select continue without a photo. And the next step is gonna allow me to pick an avatar. So this is kind of like a template faces that they have that kind of that you can match with i'm actually just going to select one of them i'm going to select this guy i'm going to select next uh within seconds we're already already creating an avatar and if this is your first time uh welcome to the channel make sure you guys hit like and make sure you guys subscribe the third step is really the fun step it's the customize the customizing part and before we get into it i just want to show you guys two Two, two navigation panels, which is the top layer, second layer, whatever this is highlighted, this is where you're gonna be selecting to change it. Right now we are selecting the skin of my avatar. So I'm gonna make him a little bit lighter. And then here are some other attributes that we can change for him. This looks like his face we're gonna change, his eye shapes, his nose shapes, uh, his lips. I'm gonna kind of run through this fast, but I want you guys that are watching this video, definitely take some time, see if you can get it as close as to yourself and then see how it turns out. Now we're actually gonna go ahead and turn out to the wardrobe. What I'm actually going for is like a Web3 space guru YouTube guy, all right? So we're gonna select uh, this uh, outfit for myself. This is actually the Dune outfit, which is awesome. Uh, we're gonna select hair. I'm gonna select this hairstyle. 
And on the left hand side, you're going to see the color wheel. And this is where you can actually change the color of the hair. I'm going to make sure he has a little bit of darker hair. The hair for me, the beard. I'm going to give him a solid, solid beard right there. Uh, this perfect. Again, the color wheel, we can change the different color of, of the beard or the hairstyle with this. I'm going to select this one to match the hair. The eyes, the eyes are really cool. They have multiple different eye sections you can select. I'm actually going to pick this really, this cool all white one and go ahead and hit the eyebrows, select something quick. And then the eyes, you have different sunglasses, different things that you can select. I'm just going to select this one. I think it's cool. Then they have like a makeup section uh, where you can, you know, different styles that you guys can kind of got you guys can kind of go into i'm just going to select this one this one looks cool and then they have different masks that you can put on or you can wear to match your style i'm actually not going to wear one i think this is this is this is it this is my guy and that's how fast i was able to create my avatar and all i'm going to do next is actually go ahead and select enter hub and right now my avatar is going to be starting to be generated and created on the back end. All right, we are back at our hub and now I can actually see my player has been created. And one of the first things I do if I create a new avatar is definitely want to put a star on him, letting him know this is going to be my main character whenever I'm using him. If we ever want to go back and edit him, you can go ahead and select this edit option right here. And you have a three tier option here where these are really cool things that we can do in the future is download the actual avatar in a GLB file. You can even share um, this avatar on our social media platforms. We can download an image and there's many, many things that we can start using our, our characters for. This is just the beginning phase. If you guys did like this video, make sure you guys give it a thumbs up. Make sure you guys subscribe to the channel and we'll see you in the next video.